What if the most used layout on Earth was never designed for speed? You're about to discover the shocking truth behind your keyboard, and it will fundamentally change how you type. Back in the 1870s, early typewriters had a huge problem. Their mechanical arms would jam if typists went too fast. They needed a solution. But therefore, instead of speeding things up, they intentionally slowed typists down. Christopher Lantham Scholes, the inventor, strategically separated commonly used letter pairs, placing them far apart. Think about T and H or S and T. They're not neighbors, are they? This forced typists to stretch, preventing jams, yet deliberately sacrificing efficiency. For years, there have been other layouts designed for pure speed, like Dvorak, that are far more efficient, but we never adopted them. Why? It's all about muscle memory and inertia. Billions of people learned Q-W-E-R-T-Y, creating a standard too entrenched to change. It wasn't about the best design, but the first one that worked. Well, sort of. So every day your fingers are dancing across a layout designed not for your speed, but for antique machinery. You're part of a global typing habit built on an almost 150-year-old compromise that...